Well, I'm, I, I'm proud of, of this team and what we were able to accomplish. Obviously, disappointed uh, in, in how the season ended, but uh, these girls should be proud of the season they had and everything they were able to accomplish this year. Yeah, it's huge. You know, the first time we went to state for the first time, uh, you build on that the second season and the third season, and hopefully we can come back to the Idaho Center and keep building on this. Um, this is the, the highest finish in the history of Parma girls basketball and the, the most wins ever in a season for Parma, so these girls have a lot to be proud of. Well, we wanted to walk into the locker room today with our heads held high, no matter what the outcome was, and, and I think we did. I think the girls understand that. I, I think it'll take a couple of days for the numbness to wear off and the disappointment, but I don't think it'll take very long for the girls to look back and, and realize how awesome this was. I started dragging her to summer basketball games when she was an incoming seventh grader. I've had her for a long time. She's Grandma Jackson to me, but uh, what she's meant to this program is, is I, I can't even put it into words how, how important she was. She has a school record for points and probably wins for a player, and uh, she leaves an incredible legacy behind.